My name is Andy Fink, came from Hamburg City, started traveling with three of my best friends, took a year off in Germany to go on an adventure and learn how to surf. Um, started 2002, um, bought some surfboard, went down here on the south coast, um, three k's down the road called Banana Beach, checked into a backpacker, stayed there for three months and learned how to surf. After a year, I decided um, to do a backpacker myself. I bought the main house, so these are like three properties. Uh, we just um, sat in the bar, had some beers, and every time we, we had an idea, I wrote it down in the bar, like at 12 o'clock at night or 1 o'clock, and then next morning we took a hammer and a nail, and then we just built. Where we, every, every time we saw a spot where we thought, this is cool, you know, there's space, let's build something into the jungle. So. We left the vegetation the way how it was or how it is and um, tried to not cut too much and try to actually build into the environment. Uh, the treehouse is actually a friend of mine, he's an architect from Germany and um, he had this vision to have uh, like a treehouse village. He motivated me to, to do this step and then we had some German carpenters here. They were traveling, they stayed for uh, like two, three months and yeah, without them, we wouldn't be able to do that. A friend of mine is um, into the glass business, so um, he sometimes supplies me with a little bit of glass which he got left over. You know, I create some stuff which, which I never thought I actually can create. My now wife did a um, yoga instructor in Thailand, and we were separated for four months, and I told her when she's coming back, I want to build a yoga studio. And it wasn't planned too much, it was just like, should we do this? Yeah, that's a good idea. Let's do this. And then, okay, should we do this? Yeah, that's a good idea. Let's do this. And it just came together. And I think it worked out quite beautifully. Well, for me, it's just important when I walk through the gate, I wake up in the morning, I come in here and I'm like, I walk through here and I just, it just makes me happy. This guy started like a couple of years ago and I saw him in Port St. John's, the Jungle Monkey, a couple of times and he, you always saw, he tried new things, he tried new things and he was still like kind of, even if sometimes it didn't sound 100%, he still kept going and really, really wanted this and I think personally now he's one of the best in South Africa, huh? he's like ripping it and he plays the guitar upside down and behind the shoulders and on his feet and plays like six, seven instruments at the same time. I think Quinton um, will be a professional very, very soon. The staff who are coming here, I always tell them, before you leave here, you have to achieve a piece, which when you come back one day with your kids or something, um, you have to say, I built that, or I did that, or I planted this tree, or you know, I painted the swimming pool or whatever, even small thing or a little picture or whatever it is, but um, this puzzle came together from like a lot of people, not only me. A lot of staff helped and a lot of friends helped and everyone helped a little bit and that's like these little stones came together and created this little paradise here.